Hey guys, you see that Black Ops reveal? Oh, you didn't? That's right, neither did I. Because Treyarch decided to ban all video cameras and everything from the event. So yeah, here we go. I'm starting here, I'm thinking maybe, you know what, I'm going to stay up a little bit longer tonight. Even though I do have school in the morning, I really want to see this Black Ops trailer before I go to bed. Hey, I'll be all nice and amped when I go to sleep. Black Ops is coming out in a couple months. So then I get a tweet, you know, the, the chat room thing from Kotaku saying, oh yeah, no video cameras. So I'm like, wow, that's pretty much, you know, terrible. And uh, I go searching all these streams and nobody can find it. I, I can't find it. I couldn't find a stream streaming gameplay. So, basically, we were just, you know, shit out of luck. So what are you going to do? You know, I don't get why Treyarch would hype this huge multiplayer reveal in their commercials and everything. Uh, and then not let people videotape it and get it on the internet for others to see and get excited about. If it's so, you know, exciting and, and brand new and revolutionizing, why don't they want to show it to the public? You know, like, why do we have to work our way around it just to watch it? I just want to watch it. I don't want to um, know the, the spoilers and campaigns and every single detail. I just want to see some more gameplay. You know, like, I don't get why Treyarch would do that. So I got another, I got Treyarch's game, World at War, right here playing. It's just a quick three minute video. And it seems like everyone's getting all pissed at Infinity War because of the noob tubes and the game is just so unbalanced, you know, and it is, but people forget about Treyarch and, man, people were bitching on this game when, uh, there was no Modern Warfare 2. Oh, Infinity War's the best thing, they make Call of Duty 4. And now that, uh, Modern Warfare 2's out, Tra Treyarch is like the new savior, you know, and people just, uh, assume that Black Ops is gonna be incredible because it has a theater mode. Something that Halo 3 had. What, how many? Two and a half years ago? I don't even know. Three years ago, probably. I think it came out in 07. Sophomore? Yeah, it's ridiculous. Ah, man, I don't know. I hope it's good, because, guys, we're all playing the same game. I hope it's just balanced. And I hope it takes skill to get kills. That's all I want. Skill for kills. You know? I don't want some kid pressing down the trigger and, and getting uh, instant spray. I want him to have a little bit of skill when he kills me. So this is a quick game. I, I think it was like a 14-0 game. I'm just throwing it out there because it's the only World of War game I had on my computer. And, um, I don't know, guys. I, I find it kind of weird that Treyarch hypes this huge multiplayer reveal up. Doesn't let any cameras. Doesn't let any recording. And now, I don't know if it's if, if we're going to see something in the morning. I'm going to try and get this uploaded tonight. But it really sucks, and I think they kind of dropped the ball. I don't know if this is a whole, like, scam with the whole multiplayer review, but... What, what good is it showing a bunch of reporters and all if they can't, uh, you know, report it? I don't know. Uh, anyway, it, this war game's almost done, so... I'm gonna go to sleep like I should have, and enjoy sweet dreams of Halo Reach.